My name is Cord Sangsteak, and I'm a design engineer here at Sheldon Manufacturing. Today, I'll be introducing the Shell Lab SMO28 Forced Air Oven. In this video, we're going to explore the features, applications, and setup processes to help you get the most from your lab equipment. Let's jump right in and learn what makes the SMO28 an amazing tool for laboratory applications. The SMO28 features a digital control panel that allows the user to set temperature and other various functions of the unit. On the control panel, you will find the temperature display, the timer display, and the over temperature alarm. This is a safety feature that prevents runaway heating of the unit. As the name implies, the SMO28 features 28 cubic foot capacity. It uses a double gasket feature along with forced air convection to provide precise and uniform temperature control. Additionally, the unit is constructed out of stainless steel and other corrosion resistant materials to prevent corrosion and increase longevity of the unit. Let's take a walk around the unit. On the left face, you will find the intake port. This is to take air from outside of the unit and flush the chamber with it. On the right face, you will find its counterpart, the exhaust port. Coming further around, we'll find the backside, which features the electrical connection for the unit. This unit must be hardwired to a securely grounded uh, electrical connection in your unit. For the purposes of this video, we have installed a power cord. There are multiple considerations to make when properly placing and installing your unit. Please refer to the user manual for details. After properly hardwiring your unit to electrical power, it is ready to be turned on. On the far left, there is a lighted power switch. This is the main power for the unit. Once you hit this, the temperature display becomes active. After a few moments, it will display the current temperature inside the chamber. This is 32 Celsius. The up and down arrows allow the user to adjust temperature set point on the fly. And this heating activated light, when on, means that power is being sent to the heating elements. To the right of the power switch is the timer switch. Turning this on will allow the timer function to be active. This allows the user to set a, a timer in minute intervals. Next, we have the OTL safety feature. This allows the user to set a specific temperature that will be cut off and prevents runaway heating of the unit. This is very easy to use, and you simply turn this dial. When this light is on, there is no power being sent to the elements. Our Shell Lab SMO28 forced air oven is perfect for use in the coatings industry, specifically aerospace, automotive, ceramic coating, and other coating materials. 